never anticipated that this would be seven years of my life. You shoot a pilot, it's all such a gamble, and then um, to sort of hit the jackpot with this show has been such a gift, I think, for all of us. Thank you to everybody. I am the luckiest person alive. And no, no. And thank you for seven awesome years, and I never want to play 20-something again. So I can't wait for my next role is hag. <laughs> but thank you for always making it a joy to be here. But thank you so much. There's a lot of emotions that come along with realizing that this is the end for Younger. I just feel so appreciative for the whole entire experience and everyone involved. You know, we're family. Really, there's just an appreciation for the many years that we've put in, you know, at this job. And then there's just a heaviness of like, that's it, it's over, we're done. Oh, thank you guys. Hey, I, I am really bad at, at um, doing this and saying goodbyes, and I feel like all butterfly and emotional, but for the people that have been here for like such a long time, like, this job means so much to me, and everyone has showed up and been there for each other and laughed when we needed to, and pulled through when we needed to, and all the new faces that, that we have this season two just fit right in, and it always was such a good feeling on set, and I love each of every one of you for showing up and being here and being kind, and I'll miss everyone. Back at you, kids. We love you. Love you. Thanks, Hillary. As I say farewell to Younger today, uh, it makes me very nostalgic. Nostalgic for the, um, the safe place that I have with my cast, uh, the joy that I get by coming to work and feeling so blessed. Leaving younger is bittersweet, because I know that I'll, I'll do more wonderful shoots in New York in my lifetime, but this has been seven seasons. Everybody had each other's backs, and we always laughed. We always came to work and laughed. I'll miss that, because you don't always get that. <sighs> what is going through my mind as I am getting ready to say farewell to the show that has shaped me in so many ways, right? I mean, this has been almost a decade. It's emotional, it's a lot. There's a lot uh, to take in. This joyous escape that y'all get to see on television, we get to live when we come to work every single day. Um, and for that, I am forever grateful. This might be the last time that all of us are together in the same room for like a long time. It's gonna be hard. I'm not, I'm not like, I haven't really been thinking about it much. And so now to voice it is actually kind of sad. <laughs> We're a big family, and I'll miss um, all of our weird inside jokes and um, all of the silly times that we have on set and the long days and the short days. You guys, this is the best show in the world and the best crew and the best cast, and I just feel like what an amazing thing that we did seven seasons of this funny, good-hearted 
beautiful show. Thank you so much for everything. I'm so just emotional. Thank you. so much affection for the people that we've gotten to do this show with. The thought of saying goodbye to it goes more through the heart than through the mind. scattered to the winds, but together like this, that won't be again. Thank you to everybody in, 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 in the, uh, the writer's very elegant way. Charles's last two words of the series uh, were thank you, um, the last, in, the, in the very last scene. And um, so I want to borrow those words to say thank you to, uh, to the crew and um, and to all of you who, who do so much and who have done so much. And there's so much that you have done that we, uh, that we know about, and there's so much that you have done that we don't know about. So for both of those things, especially the things that we don't even know about, and for those of you who are new this year, there are some of you, we've never even seen your faces. Um, so thank you. Um, and, and to our extraordinary writers, thank you. Um, and to Peter Lauer, uh, I, I, I'm, I'm so curious whether you actually know how extraordinary you are. Um, I, I do wonder about that. You're just absolutely extraordinary. Um, really. Um, and to, um, but most of all, I want to borrow those two words, thank you, um, to say something to you. And I, uh, I want to thank you for uh, your beauty, both um, inner and outer, and your excellence and your dedication to your craft, uh, and your goodness, um, and your incredible kindness and your generosity and the way that you live I, th I think that some of that is in fact in your nature um, but I do think that a lot of it is hundreds and hundreds of decisions every day to be kind and to be good and to be positive and to 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 make this show for seven years for seven years what it has been and it simply it wouldn't have been and it wouldn't have it wouldn't have been what it was without you um and i think that uh and, and i don't know uh if you know how grateful we all are and so i think that sometimes it's important to say thank you in order to make the person really understand it um, in that person's specific language. And so um, this is a thank you in your specific language. I was about to open it, I'm scared.
Ivan. Yeah, I'm gonna miss the show a lot. Thank you, sir. Thank you guys. Woohoo! Thank you for everything. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. A to B to Hillary Tech There's that beautiful saying in the theater that it's all written on water. You write it. It's there for a moment, and then it's gone. Sutton and Hillary, Miriam, Nico, Debbie, Charles, Molly, all of us together in one space, that's written on water.